Today I have a question. I have a question today. Can somebody please tell me what is the job of these so-called Kenyan women reps? What is the work of these so-called Kenyan women reps? Because every time I'm looking at these videos, all I see, I see y'all dancing, twerking, wiggling, asking for votes. When on the other hand, we have our Kenyan sisters who are dying in the Middle East, who are facing oppression, who are victims of sexual abuse, and none of you has the balls to stand up and speak. Mumenyamaza, what's your job? Today, today is a sad day for Kenya. You know, one thing I believe is when you lose one soul, it's like you've lost the whole entire nation. When you lose one soul, you've lost one whole nation. And why am I saying that? On this day, I've had to announce two deaths of our Kenyan sisters in the same country, in the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. Eunice was the first one. Nearly post your video, Lea Subui. And then, I have another sister. Let me actually check to make sure that I say her name right. Let me check. Her name is Melen Okini. Melen Okini died in Saudi Arabia today. Eunice died in Saudi Arabia today. These are young women. Young. Gone just like that. Gone just like that. I was actually watching a very painful video of uh, the last minutes of Eunice. Uh, I think she was eating some grapes. Her friends were feeding her with grapes. Leo he to me poteza was Chanawawili, Saudi Arabia. on the same day and all I could say I say God we need you we need you now God God we have to go down on our knees and pray because we need you right now we have to rebuke the spirit of premature deaths because easy V for hours, Chana, was Chana Wadogo, Ukiam Kasubui, Uya Mekufa, Nikiam Kasubui, Oh Mike, Uya Mekufa, Nikiam Kasubui. This is becoming too much, man. This is becoming too much. And the thing is, and this is the point that, this, this is actually what is frustrating. Not one single politician in the country is saying anything. They're all going about their business like everything is normal like everything is okay oh by the way we got 2022 and we have to go out there and start asking people for votes because that's what that's what we care about we care about our political positions we don't care about when we have our sisters uh who are dying 
what about the women raps? Don't even get me started. Because the only, the only terminology that I have for you, you are an embarrassment. I'm not a total. I'm not a total. You have your own daughters who are out here dying and you ain't saying anything. Eh? Like in the Kim Niki, Niki Funiki, and Galia videos in Gina Uku Nin, you are my champion, or Kutingiza Vino. Grown women. We're just asking for votes. Because the most important thing is your position. You are actually expected to say more. You are actually you are, you are actually expected to say more about what's happening. But you choose to be silent. And remember, when you choose to be silent, you become an accomplice of the evil that is happening, that is happening back in the Middle East. When you choose to be silent, you become an accomplice. Familia ya Yunis. And again, let me confirm the other, the other lady, the second one. Huh? My videos are... My videos are not cosmetic videos. They are unplugged. Melon Okinyi. Melon Okinyi, I have to remember that name. From Vote TV, our sincere condolences. Something has to happen. Something needs needs to be done. Something needs to be done. And like I say, I understand. We have a pro we have an issue with unemployment in the country. We have an issue with inflation in the country. We have an issue with um, jobs in the country. We have the, we have an issue with. High food prices, gas prices, everything is expensive. And by the way, don't get it twisted. It's the same thing up here in America too. I posted a picture just today in the morning of a group of Kenyan, young Kenyan ladies who are who at the airport going to, to, to work in Saudi Arabia. Because that's where they have, when they leave the country, Saudi Arabia is their hope. All they want to go is go over there. Wafanya kazi. Walipo ya yu yu elfu ishirini na tano. At least it's better than nothing. Wasaidia watoto wao. Wasaidia wazazi wao. Wasaweze kusupport their siblings who are going to school. Lakini hii mambu ya majeneza kila siku jameni. We have over 10 dead bodies in Saudi Arabia. Naizi vifozote zimetendeka in a time span of what? It's just a couple of weeks. Just a couple of weeks, man. Just a couple of weeks. And like I say today in the, um, on Vote TV breakfast show on TikTok, we have to now start looking at other factors like nutrition. Yeah? In the part of our channel, we have to work for 18, 16, 17, 19 hours. Huh? Chakula tu ni kubus na laban, chicken and rice. Huh? No fruits, no salads, no vitamins, no greens, no broccoli. You know, Patatu Musena Miamuka, Ivo Amianguka, and that's it. That's the end of the story. 
Do you know how many cases of sickness I have in my inboxes? People telling me, mini mgonjwa, mimi ni mgonjwa, mimi ni mgonjwa. Alafu gumuke mwarabu. Mwarabu na ye, the only medication he knows ni Panadol. Unomo na kifua? Panadol. Unomo na kichwa? Panadol. Kukuna shida ya migu, migu imefura? Panadol. And other complicated medical issues that women face? Panadol. So anyway, um, to both these families, our sincere condolences. Mimi, mimi ni mechoka ku type RIP. Let me tell you, today I'm, I don't, I don't have, how can I put it? My soul is empty today. My soul is empty. I'm tired of typing RIP. I'm tired of having to say, oh, our sincere condolences. I'm, I'm tired of that. 